Snow, 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 snow. The absolute winter relaxation. I can do it, and you can do it too. Let me show you how to implement this on your Windows 11. This of course also works on Windows 10. Open your internet browser and go to this website. The link is in the video description below. Click this link here and download the 64-bit version of this application. Your download will start automatically within 3 seconds. If it doesn't, click here for a direct link. Once the download is complete, click here to open the downloaded zip file. As you can see, the zip file contains only one executable file which needs to be extracted to any location on your disk. Note that there is no installation and administrative permissions are not required. This file is the actual application. Double click to run it. If your Windows Defender is running, it will display this message. If you click the More Info link here, you'll see that the publisher is unknown. Windows displays this message for unidentified applications. Click Run anyway to start the application. The application starts and immediately shows the default snow effect on your screen. Please subscribe. Here are some interesting things you can change in the app. This sets the amount of on-screen snowflakes. This sets the transparency of the snowflakes. This is the drop speed. Careful with this, else you might cause a snowstorm. I have to pause the video at this point. This is a long list of flakes, stars and other items. Let's go over it one by one really quickly. Just kidding, the list is too long. You'll have to check it out by yourself. Here are some of the available options. Soccer balls, red balls, flakes and stars. Here there are many to choose from. I'm sure you can find something you like. This will blow the snowflakes upwards. Use it at your own risk. This is a list of ways to deactivate the snow effect. Mouse movement, key events or both. And this timer for the effect to start again after it's deactivated. Use this to entirely activate or deactivate the snow effect. This to start the application with Windows every time you restart and this to only show the snow effect on the desktop and not on the open applications. Enjoy the snow and stay warm.